Cheers everybody. First of all, happy Easter to everybody out there. Welcome to another beer review. And in this one, we are off to the northeast of England. Hang a minute. Just had to let this one in. Right. <clears throat> Welcome to another beer review. And in this one, we're off to um, the northeast. I'm off to a brewery which I've only had one beer from before and I said to myself in the review I've got to do more from this brewery so we're off to Concept and we've got off to Concept Ale Works and we've got a traditional golden ale from them and it's entitled White Hot clocking in at 4% ABV there's a backside the, the website is fantastic it's got a real nod to the history of the town um the industry of the northeast and also it's it's just it's just aimed at you know it's it's aimed at the working class i suppose and beer is a working class drink so um check out concert hour works on the internet and and look and have a good old read at um the website it's it's really really good so have to get used to wearing these. I shall read to you what it says on the back. It says, Concept's history is forged from steel and our ales embody its past. Each one is brewed with passion and is full bodied in flavour, mixed with the purest of water, finished with love and attention by head brewer Ian Jackson to create an ale that would quench the thirst of any steel worker from yesteryear. White hot steel reaches temperatures of around 1200 degrees and this ale pours pale yellow and offers a refreshing crisp ale with a bitter finish. You can just imagine working, making steel, producing steel and at those temperatures you're going to need more than one bottle of beer at the end of a shift, I'll tell you. So let's crack it open. Don't say what hops are in. Um, the usual spill of malt, hops and yeast, plain black crown. Let's get a whiff. Slight hint of floral, hint of lemon. It smells nice, it smells fresh and summery. Let's pour it in. Very straw-like in colour. Um, not too sure if it's bottle conditioned or not, it doesn't say. Um, the previous beer I did from this lot was a stout, um, was really, really good, really good, um, traditional beer. Um, so I shall try, like I say, endeavour to get more of their beers in. Um, there's this brewery and another brewery I'm very much interested in this year, in doing all their beers from. So the beer in a glass is very clear clean looking pale gold in color bordering on straw um medium flow of carbonation going off to a dissipating white head so let's get a whiff slightly more malt on the aroma again nice fresh lemon floralness there i'm gonna go in so cheers everybody It's easy drinking. It's got that like grainy, grainy taste. Like a, it's hard to describe without making it. You know, it 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 it's a little bit like cattle feed, but. You know, it's not horrible. It's, it's it's just a description I'm trying to portray across. It's like a, a cattle feed, grainy, light taste to it. It is pleasant. Um, again, again. Mouthfeel, very fresh, very light. Not too bitter hint of lemon there but it's like a grainy I don't know I'm trying to 
cereal. I sound it, it sounds bad when I mention something like cattle feed. It's more cereal type of health bar type of taste to it. You know what I mean? It's it's a nice beer. It's it's you know it's not four percent. You expect a little bit of thin wateriness. You're not getting that, but it's like um. Do you remember years ago you used to get um, health food bars called Harf Harvey's Crunch? I think they were. I remember them at school. They were like a cereal bar. It wasn't a flapjack as such. It was like a cereal bar. I used to get different flavours. Like you had them with uh, come some raisins and you had them with um, honey. and It's like that. Um, a cereal bar. Um, is the best description because um, you know you mentioned cattle feed it sounds a little bit severe but it's 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 it's, it's just what came to my mind I'm going again the more you go in there's a more of a lemon nest coming through it's very refreshing, and like I say, it's not thin, really. It doesn't feel thin um, in taste. It's just a nice, light feel to it. So, boys and girls, um, Concert Ale Works, and they're white hot. Would I buy it again? Yeah, I would. I would. It's, it's just nice, easy drinking stuff, and you can't go wrong with it, can you? So, check out the website, like I say. Check out the brewery. Uh, very traditional and um thank you very much for watching me cheers bib bib <laughs>